all, we almost here, man. We almost here. One month, actually, a little less than a month, we get the third installment in the Creed franchise, the extended Rocky universe. Not even extended, but, you know, same universe. Each movie gets better and better, so I'm, I'm, I'm expecting this one to, like, knock me out of my fucking seat. And that's what's going to like, happen. Like, straight up. That's what's going to happen. You go see this shit in 40X, them gloves going to be on your face. I, I don't know if, if, if Creed's a 40X movie, because you might not survive that shit. Like, like the, the training that they do, I feel like that's going to pop your legs off. That's right. Straight detachable man shit. Like, I don't know if I, I can... I, no. It's the IMAX, IMAX laser, Dolby, like, that type. 40X, yeah. nah. I don't want you to knock me the fuck out yeah. mid-movie. I ain't think about it Dolby that way. When you hear the impact of the fist, it's kind of like you you hear. Mm-hmm. It's like, boom, <clears throat> like that shit. Like, I don't want to be flipping down the aisle. <laughs> and get scared of you. <laughs> no, this ain't no roller coaster shit. I don't want that. But everything I've seen about the movie gets me hyper and hyper and hyper. The the rivalry is, is believable, and and I feel like it's just gonna be like just just a great movie with great great boxing. Like whether this rivalry gets resolved or not, like I feel, I feel this this will be dope. And it's also it's also cool seeing this story, like a dude that was in his position where, you know, you kind of fall for somebody. You come back like, all right, so your life, you know, you, you went in one direction. My shit got fucked up. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to train. I'm going to get nice and I'm going to knock you the fuck out. Not, not, <laughs> Once not, I get out. Yeah, not not no like, oh, I'm going I'm to fuck your life up. Or like, I'm going to shoot your family, whatever like that. You know, like, I'm going I'm to I'm ruin your legacy. Like the way the way he, his his approach is, it's like. All right, it's a little commendable, you know, kinda. It's like you, 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 but then again, you, you're hurt because of what happened. But at the same time, you're like, okay, I'm gonna approach it this way. I can respect it. Yeah, I can, I, I, I can respect that shit. It's not. It's like like you just said. It's not like he's saying, "Yo, um, I'm pulling out the guns and shit." No, yeah. he's saying, "All right, look, I'm pissed off because I took the fall for you." He probably never went to go visit the nigga in jail. And it's not even, it's not even, actually, now that I think about it, it's not even a, a thing where he took the fall for him. It's because they were both like in juvie or whatever, like that. Like, his life went in one direction because he got, you know, adopted. Not not adopted, but like, you know, got out of there and, and, and put in this certain environment. So his life went in one direction. It's not like, the more I think about it, I'm like, yeah, he, he, did, he, he didn't get off scot free. He was still in, in there, but. One stayed, one left. Two different situations. Life went two opposite directions. But he got out. He's like, listen, I'm going to get nice. I'm going to knock you the fuck out. It is what it is. And I'm going to hurt you this way. Yeah. Okay. I'm, I'm, I'm down to see that. I'm hyped. So we got the final trail out. Let's see what Kang talking about. Apparently death. Is it Apollo Creed? Because this is a war. It's a fight. It's a battle. So, <laughs> how long have you known each other? It was like brothers. One day you came back. The past came back too. There may have been a time when Damien had your back. No friends in the industry. But that's not what he's doing now. My brothers Boom. Been my brothers Boom. Made. They don't kidding me a fan. Before I got locked up, I was the best. You a coward, bro. And a fraud. Try spending half your life in a cell. Watching somebody else live your life. I had to draw the line. I'm just getting started, little brother. I had to draw the line between my brothers and my Yeah, yeah, don't, don't, you can't look at this. I'm coming for it all. He's not gonna stop. Then you make him. You got bricks in his gloves. The one and only Adonis Creed. You're the best pound for pound fighter. Hey! Three years ago. It's been a minute since you've been out in these streets. When I walked away from boxing, I walked away with some unfinished business. You see that man right there? Do you remember him? Hey, hey. Mmm. I ain't punching the trees. I ain't doing that. I ain't doing that. I ain't doing that. Don't let him just. 
destroy everything you've built. Everything we've built. Oh. You out there boxing. I need you. Ah, uh, not again. Oh. That was military creed. Remember the last movie? Kang, Killmonger, Valkyrie, one movie. This is the extended MCU universe. This shit went a different way. Instead of saying, burn it all, he actually, like, got his life together and, and is actually doing things the right way. And I like this trailer. How about this trailer, first and foremost? Mm -hmm. how, how, how about this trailer? Um, I, I, got a, I got a good vibe from this trailer just now. I love the fact that Stephen A. Smith is interviewing him. It's like a real sports. They, they, they really brought sports into this movie and it seems mm -hmm. realistic. Um, so you know Stephen A. Smith will be saying some bullshit. Yeah, you, be, you ain't been in these streets in a minute. Um, this, is, this is the type of rivalry where this does hit home for Donnie. Because it's like me and you growing up. My life goes up. Yours goes left. You get stuck in jail and I'm living the best. And you come back and you're like, yo. I'm here to fuck your shit up. You took what I'm supposed to have. That right there kind of pisses me off because the film is going to have to show me if that's realistic. Like, how could Donnie really take the life that you had? I feel like one got caught, other one didn't. Or y'all both went to jail and one just had more... I, I don't know. It's, it's, it's the thing where, like, one, one got a lucky break, one didn't. Yeah. Because they both could have been in, in, in jail for half their life. Right. And it's like... His anger, is it really about Donnie having the life that he wants or did Donnie do some underhanded shit to make sure he got out and, you know what I'm saying? Like, I mean, he didn't do anything to make sure he got out. He got, the, the, his, 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 his father's uh, wife took him out. <laughs> took him out of juvie. Gave, gave him a home. Raised him. So it's not like he, he pulled some underhanded shit to get out. It's like he got a lucky break. Kang didn't. So now, like, while he was out and Kang was in jail, he, he got time to, like, train and be the best. It was like, before, before we went in, I was, I was the man. I got stuck in here. You got out, and you took that title, so I'm going to take it back. So, well, look, no matter the reason of what really happened, they got Creed pulling a plane with his body. If I see you pulling a plane with your body, I'm telling Sports Center the fight is off. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going I'm going live and I'm going to say hey Steve can I talk to you really quick man hey thank you for having me I saw Donnie pull the plane this thing fuck that fight it. right on Instagram live like it's, it's off y'all it's off we ain't yep. doing it <laughs> <laughs> excuse, uh, excuse me excuse me you pulling planes I ain't pulling no punches I'm out motherfucker you, you hitting the damn button now the, now the fucking thing is going up Hit the, hit the button to push down. So you got so scared of, of Kang. The down button, man. Down. More. Jesus. Kang scared you that bad? Nah, this, look, it's still, it's still too high. He fucked me God up. God damn it, man. Anyway. Got me feel like a fucking... This is the day one. You so scared that you fucking up the whole desk. I, that, that, I, can't, I can't wait to see this shit. I feel like he had pulled a desk. You got Lift one motherfucker the punching trees, the other one pulling planes. I ain't doing none of that. That's why we're not seeing this shit in 40X. Because you already scared off a trailer. I, I don't know. I just... Damn. I think I'm afraid to see the fight because the last time Creed fought somebody that fucking strong, he ended up in a hospital, wheelchair, pissing blood. Put the down button. More. Damn. Thank you. Oh, now we're Jesus. Even. How we look? And he, still fucked up, but we'll deal with it. All right. This is the day one. I can't wait to fucking see it. I feel like this is going to be one of the best boxing movies to see in a theater. We're going to be amped to fuck up. I got to watch Creed 1 and 2 before this one. And I think this is going to be a, a fantastic time. It's going to be a great story. I, I, I just can't wait. I can't wait. And cut. How the fuck and, I hit the button? <laughs> that nigga put the desk all the way up. It's that like my chin. I'm like, Jesus. You know what's crazy? I didn't even know my arm hit the... What the fuck? <laughs> I, didn't even know, I, didn't, I didn't even know my fucking arm hit the shit. <laughs> Only thing I realized was my mic was... <laughs> 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 my fucking mic was on top of my head. <laughs> Damn.
<laughs> I didn't even notice. I was speaking to straight screen. Just put right the fuck? How the fuck did I hit that? Damn. <laughs> 